Captain has the helm! The Colonel waits on Albany. I wonder what he has in mind for us to do next. Us? I thought he just wanted to check in with Monroe. Not sign me up for the army. Not at all, Shay. But I admire the Colonel's ideals and want to make them happen. What kind of ideals? Secure borders, prosperous farms, fair oh, trade. We need those in these wretched colonies. Sounds like a high-minded utopia. It rather does. Want to help make it happen? Colonel Monroe is an intriguing man. And he certainly seems honorable. We'll head for Albany. After that, I'll see. Split. Full sail ahead, lads! Drop anchor! Good health, I see. Yeah, thanks for the captain here. It is a fine vessel, Captain Cormac. Thank you, Colonel Monroe. Master Gist, did you learn more about our conspirators and their new weapons? Well, only that their base of operations is a French fort further downriver. It's a little close for comfort, isn't it? If the French have installed a fort in our territory, they are likely preparing an assault. New York could burn. Will you join us, Master Cormac? Aye. Enough innocents have died already. Uh, might I suggest we improve our vessel? The Morrigan is good, but with a few more supplies, she could be unstoppable. And you know, there's a French outpost nearby I happen to know. I like the sound of that. business are the French up to there? Just occupying the territory? It is an economic incursion more than a geographical one. Some of the ruffians are sponsored by enemies of the colonies. They intend to undermine local authorities. 
I've heard they steal from civilians and resell essential goods for ten times the price. It's always the little fella who gets scared. Fire! Colonel, I feel like yesterday I've seen inspired. Looks like something in the water or in the whiskey. Now, why do you say that, Mr. Cormac? I think Shay here is skeptical about our intentions towards our fellow man. I understand, but there is no need. I simply want these colonies to be a place of safety, development, and purpose. Funny. I thought rich men wanted them to be a place of profit. I am not a rich man, Master Cormac. Money is a means to an end. Drop not an end in and of itself. Ça patrouille. Arrête de gueuler, Landry. Fais ta patrouille, on en reparlera demain. Ça marche. Va rejoindre Tremblé. Réveille-le. C'était quoi ça C'était rien que ton imagination. Fais ta patrouille, on en reparlera demain. Le Fèvre, Marconnet est en train de dégueuler sa vie. Je te colle sa patrouille. Je vais en viser. Il est aligné. Il
Il faut veiller à ce que tout reste exactement... Good show, Shay. Now let's use those materials to give the Morrigan more firepower. Splendid! That fort and the defenders will tremble before the Morrigan. Captain Town! Your ship is in fine form, Master Cormac. That fort should offer little resistance. I rather hope the frogs offer some, else this will be a dull day. Never wish for battle, Master Gist. There is plenty around here for any of our lifetimes. Besides, if we find the fort's commander, the French will surrender, no? Indeed, that is a sensible strategy, but we will have to wear down the fort's defenses first. Otherwise, they will just dig in like a wounded bear. There's our target! Knock her down like a game of nine pins! Begin by hitting her towers. As the colonel says!
Chasseur? Say, it has been so long. Were you on a special mission? Yes, from Achilles. How interesting. So am I. Don't make me do this, Le Chasseur. We could both just leave. Ah. But then I would tell your brothers that you are alive. You have to kill me. You child! You can't escape us! Trying to give us the slip, dragon? at your business, Shay. As were you. Tell me, what are you doing in land? Special weapons. Poisonous gases to use against colonial authorities. I am merely a delivery man. Then may your final delivery be swift. Chassar was right. I... I had no other choice. If the assassins find out I'm alive, they'll come after me. While you were busy taking down that fort, I happened to stumble upon the treasury. You don't say. It 
was the damnedest thing. <clears throat> uh, well, in, in any case, amongst other things, I found maps and charts detailing various French trade routes. What are you thinking, guest? I thought perhaps we could use them to um, help the Royal Navy and fill our pockets. I stored these maps in your cabin, Captain, should you wish to use them. Master Cormac, what you have learned from Le Chasseur was confirmed. The local lawbreakers are changing tactics. What's their plan now? Their boss has hired Benjamin Franklin to produce new weapons for them. He's very well guarded. Benjamin Franklin? The scientist? You have heard of him. Good. He is making equipment to spread gases among the populace. Toxic ones, as it turns out. The populace? I thought they would use it against the authorities. Though that would be terrible as well. The ruffians we have arrested refer to an intimidating woman. I believe she is behind these nefarious plans. I look into this. Thank you. Hope. I pray it's not you. Oh! <laughs> 
Necro flies. I see him. Lost sight of him. We have to find him again. We have a clear shot. Let him think he's losing us. We'll surprise him soon enough. Keep running. Shay, oh, it is good to see you again. Your friend Hope said you were away. I, I, I was. Sir, I, I've come to collect the results of your experiments. Oh, well, it's a very good thing, then. I just finished fixing the prototype. Here you go. I was preparing to leave for Philadelphia, and then Europe. I was invited to lecture in London. Oh, would you be so kind as to inform Mistress Hope? Uh, of course. God, Hope. What are you doing with these felons? Turning the city against itself. What have you become? Something the matter, Master Cormac? Uh, no, no. Yes, just... old memories. When I am issued new recruits, burdened with regrets, I tell them the surest way to lose them is with gunpowder. You're right, Colonel. This prototype seems very powerful. Use it with care, Master Cormac. Our intelligence says this thing can destroy certain fortifications, as well as injure several enemies at once. There is also a more subtle way to use it. Some of these grenades contain a strong sedative. Fire one into the crowd and you will fall asleep. We should test this in the round. Use it against that door. Go ahead, Master Cormac. Shoot the door. Go ahead, Master Cormac. Good work. Good work. I think you were ready to turn this new weapon against the ruffians who would have used it. There is an abandoned factory nearby hiding a dangerous poison. Right now, it only causes sleep. And that's my first target. All the better. mess with this. Maybe I can break the whole system. Get him! 
Get out, or I'm as good as dead. But marvelous destruction, Captain. I saw the smoke all the way from the Morrigan. That should discourage those miscreants. New York is safe for now. With all due respect, Colonel, it's going to take more than a few explosions to get rid of this kind of trouble. The boy is right, Colonel Monroe. Shay, was it? Congratulations. You just burned the whole lot of rats out of New York. I'm Jack Weeks. This is William Johnson. I don't know about him, but I'm pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. It is, uh, terribly dusty here. I'm sure Shea can recount his adventures to us over a pint. Hey, the first round's on, uh, the Colonel, huh? <laughs> Something the matter, Master Cormac? Just a little confused. I uh, must have breathed some of that gas. Some ale will do you good. Come, we are all friends here. You will be taken care of. 